Hi, I'm Mathieu Stern, and today we're going to see how to give life back to a really old photo. But before we start the tutorial, let me tell you a little story. A long time ago in France, meet my great, great, great uncle, Mr. Albert. He was a meteorologist, scientist, and a curiosity collector. He was living in this huge house that now belongs to my mother's family. But in 1914, he died and no one really knew how he looked like. Everything he left behind him was his huge collection of weird things. And like many other curious people at that time, he was really into a new technology, photography. His huge house still belongs to my mother's family. So at the beginning of summer, I went there to look for treasures. After looking for a while, I went in the darkest room in the house. And inside a really old box, I found some broken photography gear. But inside the box, there was still three glass plates in really bad shapes. But one of them was keeping a huge surprise for me. And there it was, a selfie of Mr. Albert with his favorite dog. The quality was incredible. So I took my full frame camera and shot a picture of the negative plate to transform it into a high quality positive. And boom, here we have Monsieur Albert full black and white. But I didn't want to stop there. And I just heard about this new neural network site where you can post a black and white photo and the computer try to find the original colors of the photo by comparing to many other black and white photos online. It works best with modern black and white photo, but I wanted to see if it worked with a really, really old black and white photo. So the program just gave me an approximation of the colors of this image by using the color data of the neural network program and by using different layers of colors and different kind of fusion mode like multiply I was able to recreate an high definition colored photography of my ancestor with the actual colors he was wearing at that time and as you can see he was pretty trendy This new technique is incredible. It's revolutionary and it will change the way we see old photography. Please put in the comment section your links to your experiment with this new technique. Let me see how creative you can get with your own black and white old photographies. Please subscribe to my channel to get the next weird lenses reviews, weird experiments and many other tutorials about weird photography. And also visit my Patreon page to help me do more weird experiments. Thank you.